Hello everyone, I am back for another reading. Before I get started, I want to say, guys, my so free three-minute readings are back. You can go to my website and you can book your free uh, love reading. You'll get three minutes free. And if you want to purchase the full reading, then you can go, you know, go on the website and purchase the full reading after you get your three minutes, okay? So yes, go over to my website, dreamseer444.square.site. It is in the description box. And take advantage of your free three minutes, okay? All right, so what we have here is almost doesn't count, all right? Somebody is saying that they can't keep loving you one foot outside the door. I, get, I hear a funny hesitation of a heart that's never really sure. Somebody, you know, is telling someone like this isn't enough almost doesn't count like we almost made it we almost you know did this thing but it's not enough here because i feel that you're still hesitant i still i feel that you're still one foot in one foot out that you're not consistent or you're not going to be consistent so this could be someone wanting to work something out and another person is realizing that this person still has one foot in and out and i'm and and i'm not going to get what i deserve out of this as long as this person is in this energy of almost like where well i tried or you know you know i all we almost did no i mean it's either all or nothing here for someone is what i'm getting we also have say my name um destiny's child so somebody could have started moving funny all right somebody could have started acting as if they were single, maybe entertaining other people, acting, you know, maybe switched up because in the song, they're saying, you know, every other day I would call, you would say, baby, how's your day? But today ain't the same. So somebody switched up their love, how they, how they show love to someone else. Someone picked up on that and realized, okay, there's got to be something else going on here. You know, I feel like somebody did not put all the effort in or someone put the effort in and then pulled back, begin to change. Or this could be a warning for somebody here that maybe someone isn't giving you enough of what you deserve here. Almost doesn't count. You know, 99 and a half won't do. Somebody needs to put their all in or nothing. Someone is telling someone that. Like, you know what? Like, mm -mm. yeah, almost made you happy. Almost made you, yeah, like, I feel like somebody is mediocre. Somebody feels like their little bit of effort should be enough. Never mind the other things that they're doing. Never mind the fact that they're not contributing to the relationship, not showing up in the relationship the way they should. They want someone to just take the little, this is giving breadcrumbing energy to me. It's giving like somebody wanted someone to be com complacent with the very little that they were, they're putting in. And I feel like someone caught on to it. And yeah, somebody was paying close attention and they saw something. They saw that someone was inconsistent. Someone was deceptive. Someone was hiding something here. What's this page of sword? The ace of sword. Someone is start, was starting to see or is starting to see the truth about someone's intentions. What someone has been doing here. Maybe even behind their back. Someone's gotten clarity here that this situation is stuck it's not moving anywhere with the hangman and someone is like you know what this isn't enough this is not enough or this is what someone will end up telling someone like no queen of cups in the reverse someone could be emotionally manipulative someone here could be very um could be very uh what do you, what do you like codependent very needy or someone is like insecure or somebody could be trying to make someone feel like they're insecure or that they're just hot, being overly sensitive, like they didn't see what they saw. Someone could be wanting the truth and someone's not giving them the truth about or, or clarity about something, yet making them feel insecure in the relationship. This is giving, I'm telling you, this is giving somebody trying to make someone feel, yeah, like you're going to try to make me feel insecure by telling me that I'm not, that I'm looking at something wrong. No, you're seeing it clear that 
Eight of Pentacles, someone needs to put in more effort. Someone needs to put in work. Or this is, like I said, a warning to someone here. That somebody is not putting in enough effort. It's not enough. And eventually, you're going to realize that it's not. You're going to also realize that this person may be moving funny. That there's other people around in their energy here. Which is why they're not putting... Look at the Three of Cups coming right out. Which is why they're not putting a whole lot of effort in. You may be telling someone... That they need to step it up. Hmm. You may be telling someone that what's this three of cups? If you want, if if, if they want to really um look at this four of wands, three of swords, yeah. This is someone if you want to build a, a strong foundation with someone with someone, first of all. It looks like there needs to be some truth about a, a decision, a choice, a third party. Who someone has been dealing with. Because something here is an unhappy uh, foundation or it's going to lead to it. The four, the four of wands with the three of swords. Is this could be building a foundation that only leads to separation, unhappiness, and heartbreak. Because of the fact that someone's not putting in as much as they should one person could be putting in the effort another person may not someone may just be reaping the benefits of what someone else is putting into it five of cups somebody needs to release a third party first of all that's coming out here heavy i feel like someone's intuition is telling them this so someone needs to listen to their intuition when it comes to a person yeah here we go the devil with the lovers someone could be in a car have a karmic connection is still going on here and this is why it almost doesn't count why somebody is still you know kind of one foot in one foot out because they're they could be caught between a karmic connection and between a soulmate connection right so yeah i feel like someone is starting to to evaluate the the effort that they're putting into a net connection because i feel like they're getting messages you could be getting messages that something here isn't right something here isn't right someone's not giving wholeheartedly here what is this person's intention this person is not giving wholeheartedly what is this that they're trying to do ace of cups so somebody wants a new beginning somebody wants the new love What's the what's challenging it? Because I'm seeing a lot of I'm seeing a lot of uh, influence here. Someone could could be still intimate with another person because these people are naked on here. Someone could be sleeping with two people, and I don't like that. I I don't like that at all because this could be I'm get, I'm hearing cross contamination. Somebody could be really messing with a divine partnership and still dealing with a karmic and getting somebody's energy all crossed up here but yet one in the ace of cups with someone still focusing on a three on something from the past six of swords five of swords the sun and somebody here needs to realize that they are in danger of sabotaging a, a opportunity here to have a marriage or a long-term commitment that is actually good and healthy because they're choosing to still entertain other options, other things here. And someone's going to be led away to move on. Okay? So somebody's going to sabotage a situation and be forced to, like, see someone else move on to calmer waters elsewhere. And that's when it's going to hit them. Like, oh, my goodness, my happiness, my foundation is gone. All right, so this is what I have, guys. Let me know if this resonates for you, with you. Hit the like button, share, comment, guys. And I have to look at the Six of Pentacles was just popping out. Um, somebody given to two situations. All right, I'll see you guys on the next one. Have a good day.